Okay. This, this is time for Ugandans to rise up. How can the Speaker of Parliament earn 4,500 shillings a day? 20 million shillings a day. 4,500 US dollars. 20 million shillings a day. How can an ordinary member of parliament earn 1 million shillings a day? There is no MP who earns less than 30 million a month. Ask me. I was there. This does not include even the travel allowances and inland and outland travel. Ugandans are being fooled. 20 million shillings a day. How do you explain that? How do you explain an individual in government buying two Mercedes Benz for 600 million and for 800 million? How do you explain in a space of four years someone having a house in Kololo, someone having a hospital where? How do you explain that? Ugandans are being fooled. Look at the convoys of the speaker and the deputy speaker. Over 40 vehicles in the convoy. Why are the taxpayers being fooled? Who is fooling who? I think this is not acceptable. This is not why some people went to the bush. The revolution is losing its meaning. A policeman is earning 400,000. A UPDF soldier sleeping in the barracks in Kabong is earning 270,000. When a policeman asks for 2,000 from a traffic, from a vehicle driver, you say the policeman is asking for a bribe. And for you, you are getting 20 million shillings a month. We are going to come to that parliament in thousands. We are going to come. Power belongs to the people. This is a total abuse to Uganda. This is totally not acceptable. And we have to do something and we are going to do something about it.